Dining out tonight, guys. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> it's the first Smart Travel event of this year, and uh, we have a big crew out. We've nearly half a century, almost 50, and we're on leg two. We had mocktails in the town hall, yeah. and here we are at the New Look Towers Hotel down yeah. on the quay. Absolutely singing, and uh, the food <laughs> is delicious inside. We move on to Westport House, and we end up in Hotel Westport. And we have guests here from Shropshire in the UK, Stuart. And we also have guests from Fromoy with Mary and Carolyn up, particularly for the bike buffet today. Good evening from the People's Republic of Cork. And have you ever done this before? Absolutely not, and it's fantastic. I haven't been on a bike for a decade, and I'm going to go home and take my own one out of the dust. <laughs> You're going to take this, get the island, the three in one island. Yeah. too. Maybe right, Tom. Tires. Oh, it's yeah, a new, yeah. a new venture for you. It's new venture, yeah. Uh, dealing with cyclists. Dealing with cyclists, yeah. used to it. You're up to the game. Up to the game, I am indeed. New yeah, premises. New premises. Or an additional premises, additional I should have said. Yeah, coming home to the, the key where I'm from. Oh, this is where you're from, of yeah. course, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, so it's nice to get back out here. Yeah. You know. So what's on the menu tonight for these lot? Um, tonight, with, well, Mayo Day and all that, we're doing a wild uh, garlic soup and we're doing a tomato-based curucon. So it's a green and red. Okay, yeah. Uh, and some nice fresh salmon cakes. Well, so they have the choice. Mm -hmm. And they're themed in the male colours. Absolutely, yeah. yeah. Because it's male day. Because yeah. it is male day. Is it male day? Because it is male day. And this is Stuart from Shrewsbury in Shropshire. And he's here particularly for the Smarter Travel Buffet. Yeah. Maybe you might like to say something about your experiences today, Stuart? No. Today, well, have you been to Westport? Simon came and told us all about Westport in Shrewsbury okay. a couple of months ago. Mm. He converted us to come and, uh, because I worked in Bell Mullet from 1966 to 1969. I thought we'd take a chance to go and see the Mullet as well. So we'll head back up there tomorrow. Stuart studied his PhD on the rock formations of the Mullet Peninsula in what year? 66 to 69. <laughs> it's the first time he's been back since, is it? He was back once. I was working in a landfill in Balladrine and I took right. a day off to go up there. Once. Certainly have got unusual jobs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. so oh, there's nothing, so, more, nothing more romantic than that. So, so what do you think of Westport now? I think Westport's amazing. Mm. It's lovely. If the, if the weather's always like this, you shouldn't tell too many people about it because it'd be crowded out. Well, we, 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 we manage them if they come. Don't <laughs> <laughs> right, worry, Pamela. That's right. Yeah? You have something to do with all this stuff, yeah? Westport as well. I was involved in the Smarter Travel from day one, and I think it's the best thing after Tidy Towns, of course, that has ever hit Westport. It's addictive. I wouldn't miss bike, bike buffet for anything. And look where we are. Clue Bay, most beautiful, fabulous venue you have here. Tom, I think you should join us for the next bike buffet. I think and I will, yeah. You, you, it's absolutely fabulous. I wouldn't miss it for the world. And Mary from Fromoy on a visit day, who's also Ryan Tuberty's architectural advisor and I appears am, on I, Radio 1 I from am, time to time. In fact, I'm channeling Ryan as we speak. And <laughs> on the basis of that, may I say that Westport is an inspiration not just to Mayo and indeed to Connacht, but to the rest of us in Ireland. It's an extraordinary achievement mm. and we're delighted to be able to come and experience it. We wish we could bring it down to Cork and all the Cork is indeed, as you know, marvellous. No, they're not bad down there either, yeah. It's quite marvellous, but we, we could actually, um, I think, uh, upgrade a little bit and take on some of the excellent ideas that Westport has embraced, seemingly without hesitation. Well, you can't have Simon or you can't have Pamela. But you, can, know, but you can have some. <laughs> you can have some of them bottles behind you that's been dumped. <laughs> well, we're just going to take the memories back and hope to recreate them as an actual reality in Cork because it really is fabulous. It's, it's You've been different. here before, yeah? Uh, not for a couple of years. Not for a couple years. Yeah. Yeah, there's big changes here, yeah. There always are. Anyway, enjoy enjoy the uh, food. And Mary's here with her sister Caroline as well. So the, oh, Caroline. The dual delegation. <laughs> so the rest of them are inside waiting for you. I won't hold you any longer, guys. They are. So we're shop We're very hungry after the cycle. Mm. Uh, the food will make up for the, the cycle, I'd say. Mm. Can you drink and cycle, by the way? Um, well, uh, I'm sure you can, but what we have, we instead of the starters of a cocktail, we have what's called a mocktail, yeah. which is a non-alcoholic cocktail. I think that might suit them all around here, but well, anyway. You might be able to uh, eat and cycle, or a drink and cycle, but possibly only do one of those very well. <laughs> I have seen a few hip flasks. Okay. I, I don't want to expose anyone. <laughs> Ten years as a magistrate, we had one man drunk in charge of a bicycle. Oh. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> You're a magistrate, yeah? I was. You were yeah, a magistrate. Was you must have learned that from the rocks down in Belmullet, yeah. 